I've dreamed my whole life about saving her. At what cost? This is why you became the Flash. You have to change the past. Who are you? It's Barry. Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Pager here once again with another video for you guys. What you just watched there was the episode 23 or the finale trailer for season 1 of The Flash. And in this trailer, we essentially just get the introduction to the Flashpoint Paradox, which I'm assuming will be the whole of season 2, if not essentially the whole of season 2, yeah, maybe apart from like the past, the last two or maybe the last episode. Now, just spoiler alert, quickly, I will explain what the Flashpoint Paradox is pretty quickly. Now, the Flashpoint Paradox just basically involves Barry going back in time and stopping the reverse Flash from killing his mum, which hence changes the future or the present time that he was actually in. So it essentially creates an alternate timeline where things are very different. Now there actually is an animated movie you can go watch called Operation Flashpoint I think it's called, maybe Flashpoint Paradox? I think it's Operation Flashpoint. I will link the IMDB in the description below. But you can go watch that, it basically explains everything, it basically gives you a rundown of what's happening and what could happen within season two, minus Batman and all the different members of the Justice League. There also was a Green, Re uh, Green Lantern reference in the uh, episode 22 of The Flash, which I thought was pretty interesting and a really nice touch that they could add. Now essentially what I can see happening in season two is with this alternate timeline, they could actually finally introduce Caitlin Snow actually becoming Killer Frost. They could actually make Cisco become Vibe, which are their characters or the heroes and villains in the comic books and this could actually introduce Wally West into the universe. Now this actually could involve at the end of season 2 if he does decide to change the timeline again and stop himself from going back and stopping the reverse flash. It could actually make Wally West disappear and make everything back to normal but we'll have to wait and see how they actually uh figure out the season actually play it out but overall I'm pretty excited for what they're probably going to do in season two and I think it'll actually make the show even better create a better story and actually fill people in and actually draw more people to the show but overall I'm looking, really looking forward to the finale now now that I know what's actually going to be happening in it but there'll obviously be more than him just going back in time I think it'll be about half an episode of them figuring out what to do with the reverse flash and then the last half will be setting up season two with him actually going back in time and stopping the reverse flash but anyway leave your opinions in the comment section below what do you think is going to happen in this finale what do you think they're going to do in season two do you think they might not do flashpoint paradox do you think they might do something else but if you do agree with me what do you think they could else they could add to the ultimate timeline maybe joe dies maybe maybe his dad dies who knows what happens but leave those opinions in the comment section below leave a like if you enjoyed the video and make sure to subscribe if you're new i try to do a video every one to two days to just try and stay up to date. But I will be doing an Arrow finale review tomorrow, so make sure you subscribe to uh, catch that video. But anyway, guys, make sure to follow me on Twitter. That link will be in the description below. And I'll catch you on the next video, guys. Goodbye.